Welcome to English Grammar Lessons. Today we'll discuss the topic gerund and infinitive. We'll take the first topic gerund in English grammar. So, what is a gerund? The ing form used as a noun form. Infinitive plus ing. Examples. Gerund as subject. Going to parties is fun. Gerund as object. I enjoy reading. Gerund after the following verbs. Admit. He admitted having driven too fast. Avoid. They avoid going on holiday on Saturdays. Carry on. If we carry on sleeping so badly, we may need help. Consider. Ralph is considering buying a new house. Delay. I delayed telling Max the news. Deny. She denies reading the book. Dislike. We dislike reading poems. Can't. Couldn't help. He couldn't help falling in love with her. Enjoy. I enjoy playing chess. Finish. They finished working in the garden. Give up. Susan gives up playing ice hockey. Imagine. He imagined driving a new car. Include. Your responsibility includes taking reservations on the phone. Involve. The project will involve growing plants. Justify. I cannot justify paying $100 for this ticket. Keep on. They keep on running. Mention. Did Alex ever mention playing baseball? Mind. I don't mind sleeping on the couch. Miss. They miss playing with their friends. Practice. She practiced playing hockey. Regret. Do you regret having mentioned it? Risk. You risk catching a cold. Suggest. See, she suggested flying to Cairo. After regret, the infinitive is used when announcing bad news. We regret to inform you that the flight to money has been cancelled. Gerund after special phrases. To be busy. He is busy reading the paper. Don't mind. I don't mind telling them my opinion. Feel like. We feel like having a cup of tea. How about? How about walking home instead of taking a car? It's no good. It's no good talking to this girl. It's no use. It's no use talking to the headmaster. Spend one's time. They spend their time reading. There is no. There is no cheating anymore. There is no point. There is no point in complaining further. What about? What about going to the zoo? Worse. The book is worth reading. Well, this was... The topic gerund in English grammar with Luna Muru. Thanks for watching.